Chief Fleshi uh, Honor Walk. It's an annual event held here at the base since 2008. We haven't been able, able to do it the last two or three years because of COVID. Uh, but basically the event is a chance for the base and the Nisqually tribe to come together and really uh, pay homage to uh, the native lands that are, are here set before us. Chief Leshai Honor Walk in honor of not only the chief here at Leshai, but the, the individuals with the allotments. So this area here that we walk on is an allotted land for, for my people. Bringing them here to walk would then show them the area and how massive, I would say, the spaces that we, that we would live in. Up here to the left, it'll take us down to a spring head where that's where the chum salmon, our winter chum I mean, chum every salmon year it's spawn. a different feeling for me. Being able to come here and walk on this land, to me it gives me that energy and that feeling of, you know, this is, this is who we are, or this is where we come from. Every year it's different with the, with the, the, the scenery, um, and then now this year with the people, so I'm glad I have more uh, uh, outside of my community coming to this, to this walk and listening. When I was selected to help lead this and work with the tribe to coordinate it, very, very honored to learn more about their history, their tribe, and these, these beautiful lands we have before us. It's really significant um, to the Nisqually Indian tribe, but also to the base community uh, because of the rare chance that, uh, for us to, to come together, but um, the significance of the deep history of the tribe and us to be able to learn more about it as, uh, as the base community itself. I thought the relationship is important, a real honest relationship because it, it feels better and, it, and, it, and it's more like concrete and, and, it, and, it, and it comes from a better space when you talk about it like that. So I thank JBLM and Fort Lewis for preserving such a beautiful area. We acknowledge that Joint Base Lewis McCord resides on the traditional lands of the Nisqually people. The Nisqually have lived and cared for this land and these waterways since time immemorial. We make this acknowledgement to open a space of recognition, inclusion, and respect for our sovereign tribal partners and all indigenous students, families, and staff in our community.